Oh, man. So what does it take to get some ice cream around this place? Seriously, I've been hanging out here for like 10 minutes down at the lake. Can't find anyone to get me some ice cream. Hey, oh, what are you? Hey, are you, uh, are you, are you, ooh. You don't look like you're serving ice cream, do you? Um, okay. Yeah, just, yeah, go back in behind there and then get me, I'll take a, a hey, are, what, what are you doing, man? Give me a cone. What is with this place? <laughs> just want an ice cream cone. Hmm. Anyways, um, I was going to come down here for the morning and just kind of enjoy the relaxing view down here. Go find a beach, maybe. Hang out for the afternoon. Yeah, Uncle Joe's got better plans for me, apparently. Uh, I have a funny feeling I'm going to see a lot more of this coming up soon, guys. Um, I guess, uh, yeah, his ranch hand didn't show up today. I got some animals to feed. Yeah, we got a bunch of animals to feed, of course. And uh, you know what? He's got pretty much everything up there. Yeah, so much for my relaxing day at the beach. Oh, well. Anyways, jump in the Toyota. Let's go for a cruise. Head back up to the farm. If I can get this done in like an hour, maybe we can come back down here. See if this ice cream guy makes it back. Hey, what about you? Are you the ice cream guy? Hey, listen to me. Clutch simulations. So, folks, what's going on today? Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. We are uh, hanging out on the farm here. I think I missed my turn. You know what? We'll go back over this way. No, I didn't. We're good. Oh, man. Like I said, oh, Lake, Lake Land Vale. Man, great county over here. I do enjoy it. Relaxing. Everyone's uh, kind of got their own thing going on. I just wish I could get some ice cream. That's all. <laughs> um, so we've got a couple things to take care of today. Uh, just some chorin for old Uncle Joe here. Since he's, well, I don't even know where the heck he is. Is it Mexico? Bermuda? I have no clue. Guy's leaving all the work for us to do down here. We'll cut through the town here. Um, yeah, so we'll be hanging out up here, doing a little bit of choring for today. I don't know what to expect from this, guys. I mean, we'll see how far we go with this, but, uh, yeah, we've got a lot of animals to deal with. i got to figure out the equipment he's got. Like, no instructions, just, yeah, hey, hey, Clutch, get up there. Can you feed up the cattle for me and the chickens and the sheep? Hey, we've got pigs and horses, too. Can you, can you take care of all that? That'd be great. Thanks. Yeah, sure. Thanks, Uncle Joe. I'm on it. I'm on that, buddy. So there's the farm right there. We'll pull in. I don't think anyone's here, it sounds like. Um, yeah, I guess his regular guy is, uh, I don't know, maybe called in with the Kenora virus. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> you got me. Uh, look at all the chickens here. Who keeps their chickens just out in their front yard? Come on, man. It's ridiculous. Uh, you know what? Let's start with the chickens. We'll get these, these little buggers fed up. And uh, yeah, why not? That, that'll work. Perfect. Stop it right there. Excellent. You know what? Is that a soccer net in the back we got there? I should come by and get some soccer one of these days. Um, so, chickens. What do we need for chickens? Ah, we got some water and some chicken feed, I guess. Well, I think we could do water pretty easily. Let's just we just crank this on. This is all we have to do? Oh, that's it. Okay. we got. Well, that's it. They got water. Um, well, this is done. Okay, let's get some feed. This, is, this isn't too bad. Uh, this shouldn't be too bad. Let's, let's get to work on this, guys. Let's pitter-patter here. I see a silo that I'm assuming will be where we get our chicken. What else does he got? Yeah, I'm sure we'll get the food from there. Let's see, what do we got here? I see a couple John Deere. We got the six and we used yesterday right there. Let's, uh... Okay, we got a bin right here. We can use that. Let's see, we got keys in this one. Actually, we'll just grab this tractor right here. What is this? What do we got here? What is this thing? It's a little bit older. I don't even know what model this is. Huh. Um... Uh, that'll work. Let's jump in. Let's take, let's take it for a spin. Keys, 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 keys. Um, oh, there we go. Good, good, good. Let's fire it up. Nice. All right, perfect. I like it. We'll get this off the ground. Let's go grab this bin. Um, and, uh, yeah, we could just use this to grab some chicken feed. I think that'll work. Stop it right there. Back this thing on up. All right, let's go hook up to this trailer. That looks perfect. Perfect! Alright, back into the tractor, and uh, away we go. So we should be able to get some feed on this. That'll be uh, a quick job. Chickens will be done in like two seconds, as long as I can get feed out of this uh, this bin up here. Guys, we'll be uh, we, we'll be back on the beach before you know it. Might be able to get a little bit of tannin going on. We all know I can use it. <laughs> Bin's turned on. Alright, good, good, good. Shut that down. And let's take a look. How much should we get? Oh, wow, I almost overfilled it. That was close. 
Uh, all right, perfect. We got lots, lots in there. I looked inside, and there was a ton of wheat inside there. Uh, I'm gonna have to go dump this back in. I'm sure afterwards. There's no way the chickens are gonna take this much. All right, let's go dump this back. Go up by the, the Toyota over there, and uh, let's dump it in. They got a trough sitting there. Yeah, I hope this, this is all it takes. If we could get away with this, something quick for each one of these uh, animals we've got out here. Man, this is an easy job then, right? All right, so we can uh, dump this out of the back. So I'm going to have to back this in. Perfect. And back her on up. Nice and easy like. Nice and easy like. Perfect. And dump. Looks good. Looks good. Look at all the... Perfect. Chickens are happy. They got their food. All right. One done. Uh, what do we got? We got cows, pigs, sheep, and horses left. Holy. Um... A lot. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's. Uh, we're gonna go dump this back into uh, the silo here. We're not gonna need this anymore. Let's go for a walkabout and see what else are we gonna need here. Um, I don't even know what all the animals they got up here. Huh. Just going down the equipment line. I see we got looks like a pig food mixer. We got a silage mixer of sorts, uh, and we got this Mikhail. Uh, what is this? A straw baler here. Straw shredder. So we'll probably use all of these. Um, yeah, I almost need a second tractor here, don't I? Hmm, <laughs> you know what? We'll bring the McHale down below. Um, when we drove in the other day, we drove past where the cattle area was. I think that's where we'll stick this down there. Because I think we got pigs. I think there are pigs and cattle. I think there's horses down there as well. So uh, we'll stick that all down there. Now, what are we doing for bales, 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 bales? Um, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We got lots of silage there, it looks like. Okay, that's good. Uh, bales, bales, bales. Oh, there's the bales. Uh, this would be for sheep, it looks like. You know what? We can just stop quickly here. I'll go run and give these guys some water. How much water do they got? It looks like they're doing okay. We can quickly turn this on, though. Give them a little bit more water. Uh, we'll throw some bales in there in a second. Looks like they got some straw? You know what? Come to think of it, I'm pretty sure... You know what? We could save these bales. Instead of using the bales, I saw some grass back in the barn back there. There's a barn right back... Yeah, right in front of the green barn there. I'm going to go load up that other trailer. We'll leave the McHale here. And, uh, yeah, we'll just grab a, a trailer with, with grass in it. That'll be way easier than trying to bust up a bale and throw it in there. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Let me just go back. We'll leave the McHale kind of right over here on the right. And uh, we'll run down, fill up one of that... Uh, we'll fill up that bin with, uh, with some grass. Let me just go disconnect this. Perfect. And from here, we can go and uh, just go and grab the... Just some, just some hay. I think, I think he's got hay in there. I think he said he had hay. I don't know. I thought I saw hay in there. And uh, we'll grab that instead of busting up a bale. You can save those bales for later on if he wants. Oh, man, I should have done this beforehand. You know what? We'll leave the... Uh, we'll probably use this for cattle as well. I'm going to think if we're going to need that or not. Um, we're probably going to need some hay for the cattle, aren't we? I mean, we'll, we'll definitely need it for uh, the horses, I suppose, as well. So... You know what, that's, that's going to be a bit of a pain. But anyways, let's uh, go to the old barn right here. We'll get uh, loaded up and head back around. Apparently he needs a hay dryer. I thought it was hay. It's actually just grass. That's okay. They'll take it anyways. It's fine. It's not a problem. Uh, let's back this in here. Excellent. Nice and easy. All right. All right. And that'll work right there. Perfect. Now, how much grass do they need? That should do about right about there, I guess. All right, let's go turn this off. Oh, jump on in. All right, put her back down. And um, I don't see how much do we use here. Pretty much all of it. Wow, they got all of it in there. <laughs> they took it all. All right, guys. Well, whatever. That's fine. We can get another load of grass and bring it down below. Huh, I wasn't expecting that. That's a lot. You know what? Uh, the horses will need some grass, so I'll grab a trailer full. We'll bring this down first. Man, I'm got a lot of driving to do. But two animals down, three left to go. Grabbed some oat. We got a trailer full of oat now. I grabbed a couple of hay bales as well. I just found sitting over there a couple square hay bales. Uh, that'll make life a little bit easier. I was going to fill up with hay or with grass again, but you know what? It's a little bit easier if we get... Oh, don't tip off. Don't tip off. Nice and easy. Into the woods down here. Uh, we'll go finish off our horses right now as well. So this is, we'll be done two of three, or three of, three of five? Three of five. Yeah, I can do math. Really, I can. I can't see anything. It's, <laughs> the hay bales tipped up. I can't see. I hope there's no cliff here. Oh, no whammies, no whammies, no whammies. Oh, I think we're okay. Where's the road? Oh, 
There it is. There it is. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Perfect. Oh, man. All right. So we got pigs there. Cattle here. Uh, where's the horses? I thought they were down at this end someplace. I thought we drove past them yesterday. Where is this? Where is his horses? Oh, over there. They're on the other side of the barn. Oh, man. I missed the, missed the road. I, really, I, I've been here before. Really, I promise I have. <laughs> It'll spin around. Oh, man. What a pain. Uh, I guess we had some more round bales sitting in there. I could have grabbed one of those, I guess. But you know what? We could take two square bales. I think we'd be hard-pressed to try to carry two round bales with us. This is probably better off anyways. That's okay. All right. Through the woods. Uh, where is this horse pasture? It's, it's over here, right? Someone tell me it's over here. Is this it? Yeah, there it is. <laughs> I know I saw it. We drove right on past it the other day. All right. Let's go. Uh, let's go give these horses what they want. I'm sure this is all we, this is what they need, right? A little bit of, oh, oh, I lost it. Oh, watch out. This driver barbs him. Um, we'll be good. Let's just drop this right here for now. I'll have to figure this all out. I'll have to go get that other bale hooked up. That wasn't supposed to happen. All right, one bale in. Let's spin this thing around. We'll drop off the oats as well. And uh, we'll grab that other bale and toss it in there as well. <laughs> Before I drive back over it. Oh, bad. All right, get right up against the edge. Open this guy up. Well, that's dumping out. They got their oats in now. Uh, let's open this here up. Oh, man, they're dry. No water whatsoever. That's not a good thing. All right, they're good. We've got some water going in. Excellent. I like it. All right, perfect. That looks like it's almost empty. Is it empty? Totally empty. All right, guys, we're going to probably get some more, uh, some more grass and I bet you some more uh, oats for these guys at some point. But he's just asking for me to take care of him for the day. I'm not even getting paid for this. I'm just doing this because I'm a nice guy. Let's be perfectly honest here. Back this thing back on up. And put her back in. All right. Drop her in. Oh, watch out. <laughs> nice. All right. Oats and water. We do need to get some straw for them. Uh, but we'll have to go get that McHale and bring it back down here. I think that's really what we need. That, uh, that bale buster is going to need to come down for the straw, of course. I think we've got a ton of bales are sitting inside that Quonset right there. We'll grab those. So, for the most part, three animals done. We've got cows and pigs left. Eh, what do we need for cows and pigs? What do they need to be fed? It's been a while. I think we can figure this out, though. Um, you know what? Let's stop right here. I see water. We can get this out of the way. Turn this valve. Turn the valve. Turn the valve. Oh, it's full. Hey, look at that. It's full. Disregard. We don't need to turn the valve. Let's check on... Uh, that's our little pigs right there, right? Look at all those pigs out there. He's got a ton of them. Let's go check on the cattle and see how they're looking. Yeah, should have done this when we're over here. The trough is empty. There we go. Get some water for these guys. Um, they're almost out of food, too. I really need to take care of that. All right, we'll worry about... Uh, we'll get the food down here right away. Then we'll worry about the bedding. Food first, then bedding. That's the way we're going to run this. Yeah, I definitely need to do the fruit first. Food first. Ah, so minor problem I just realized. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do this all that quickly. I can grab the bales down below, but I can't do the silage because I don't have a bucket on this tractor. Um, you know what? I saw a telehandler behind me. I'll use that. So let's just, uh, we'll get some product in here right now. Drop that off. We'll grab a couple bales. We'll toss the bales in there. Get these things mixed up. Take the telehandler, go up top, and uh, take the telehandler and go and unload some silage. One bucket full of silage in there. I think that'll be the best bet, right? Let's throw one of these bad boys in there. Just like so. Can I get around the front? Oh, no, no, no. Let's go this side instead. We'll pull a Yui here and then go grab a hay bale. Do the same thing. I don't know. I can't remember. Is it two we could fit in there? I can never remember the ratio on this off the top of my head. I need to go check the notes again. A little higher, a little higher. Oh. There we go. Push in, push in, and perfect. All right, one done. Let's go grab a hay bale, do the same thing, and then, guys, we're going to head up top. Grab that telehandler. I saw a massive bucket on that thing, and, uh, yeah, that should really work for us. Oh, that'll work for us for sure. Oh, <laughs> no, sorry, Uncle Joe. Knocking over bales on you. Sorry, bro. It's all right, though. <laughs> I'll clean it later, I promise. All right, guys, got the mixer just fired up there waiting for some silage. Let's go up and take the telehandler. I remember, I remember the uh, the ratio. Two hay bales, one straw. 
and then fill the rest with silage. And with that particular unit, that should give us what we need. So, let's grab this bucket. We'll fill the rest with silage for now. And I think that should give us everything we're going to be looking for for this. Oh, I can't see it. Look at how big this bloody bucket is. Yeah, I can't see it. That's the thing. we got to lift it up above us. <laughs> really not the way you want to be driving. Oh, man. All right, so let's go get some silage. We'll have to take that tarp off. I think. I don't think. I, I hope that's all right. I didn't see uh, I didn't see anything open on the second pit though, so I'm sure it should be fine, right? Looks like we've got manure on the right, silage on the left. Is there a song about that? Stuck in the middle with you? I don't know. Uh, yeah, so this one's empty. Just grass here. I don't want grass. We need. Let's get this off. Go. That's what we want right there. There's that. That's what I'm looking for. All right, let's go grab this. Put her back in gear. Might help. Nice. And dive in. Perfect. Oh, all right. Let's head back on down. We got a load of silage. Load that uh, mixer up and get done with these cattle. Go, 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 go. Guys, at this rate, we might be able to get to the beach right after lunch. We're, we're making some good time here. Feeding all these animals. Oh, man. Nice and quick. Dumpy dump. Look at that. Get in there. Fill that thing up. Yes. Love it. All right, that should be pretty much full. And uh, I can put this away for the time being. Let's go put this back where we found it for now. I'm probably gonna need this for some root crop vegetables, mind you, uh, for the pigs. But let's get these cattle fed. Turn that off, run over here. We'll get this taken care of. Is this still on? Yeah, it turned off. What the heck? Huh, weird, all right. Anyways, looks good to me. No, oh, stalled again. Oh, come on, what is going on with this thing? Okay. Easy, easy. Engage the PTO. Uh, it sounds a little funny to me. I don't know if it sounds funny to you guys. It sounds funny to me, though. Ah, rabble. Our ratios are just a touch off. I need some more TMR. Just a touch more TMR. Darn it, guys. <laughs> I thought we were close. I thought that one bucket would be enough. It's not quite TMR. Let's go run back up to the top, and uh, we'll fi finish this off. Oh, I thought we had like a perfect amount with this bucket. Apparently, I am not quite right. I've been there before. I've definitely been there before. All right, this better be enough. I think we're going to be actually overflowing here. We better watch ourselves. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. And dump. Go, go, go. All right. Check our ratios. That looks a little bit better. I think that'll be better. All right. Uh, I think we fit a little bit more in there. Let's keep on dumping it in. And I think we should be alright now, guys. Alright, there we go. Excellent. Let's unload all this. Should uh, pretty much take everything in here, I think. It's going to be quite a bit. So we'll unload all this into our cattle and they'll be happy. They got lots of food now. All I got to worry about is the bedding. We'll have to run up top and grab the McHale um, bale spreader or the bale uh, destroyer. I can't remember what I want to call that. <laughs> the bale buster. And uh, we'll take care of the rest. Alright, let's head back on up. Finally ran into a little bit of luck as well. I thought I was going to have to mix all the pig food up. There's pig food in the silo! He's got pig food already mixed for me. Because it's just a tiny little mixer. I was thinking that that was going to be a bit of a... Uh, um, I don't know what the right word that I could say would be. I don't think anyone's going to want me here. So, um, anyways, I want to check the silo. They have tons of pig food in the silo. I don't got to mix nothing. We got to mix nothing at all. I can just go grab it, bring it down here, and call it a day. Um, you know what? One trailer load. That should be enough to get me to the beach. So, uh, yeah. Let's finish this off. Drop this in. Boom. Pig food in. Excellent. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little far away, guys. I'm a little bit far away. <laughs> it's alright. It's going in. I promise you it's going in. Alright, piggies. You'd be happy with that. You know what? I gotta get some bedding still. But, uh, that's it, guys. We're fed. I can't believe we're already fed. It's not even noon yet. It's like an hour and a half worth of work just quickly going through this as fast as I possibly can. Uh, so, horses, pigs, cows need bedding. And that's it. Let me go grab the kale. Guys, things have been running so smoothly. I feel like I'm a bit of an animal whisperer today. I don't know. What do you guys think? I think, uh, I think I'm, uh, this is my new, new calling. Um, maybe we should do this over our brown, no, um, let's not do that. Let's get some brown water going again. I think that's where, really where, uh, where it's at. This is too much work. <laughs> uh, drop that in a little bit further. There we go. Back on out. 
Oh, oh. There we go. Perfect. I love it. All right. Let's go uh, over to Piggy Pigs. Get this bale busted up in there. And then cattle. And then lastly, horses. Go, go, go. All right. Last bale. And we can get to the beach. That's all I'm worried about. It's almost noon. Come on, man. I got, I got stuff to do. <laughs> I hate this. We're so close. Ah, uh, man. You know what? The funny thing is I'm probably going to get a phone call as soon as we're done this. Hey, Clutch, uh, can you uh, go do something else for me? Maybe, like, go plant a field or, I don't know, something. All right, bail gone. Horses are all happy. What do we, do we have, like, a riding arena out here? Is that what he's got going on? Oh, like a mini mini riding arena. I didn't even know he had this out here. Huh, that's kind of cool. Anyways, that's uh, that's it. Let's get out of here. We can get back to our day. Quit worrying about this before it gets uh, taken out by something else. I'm sure he's got some other plans for me at some point. <laughs> oh, bad. Anyways, um, you know what? That one thing I did notice, that silage pit he's got up there, it's ridiculous. There is so much silage there. I'm a little worried that uh, that's going to be where I'm living at some point, digging that all out. I could just foresee that being a thing. Like, I mean, really, look at this pit. This is ridiculous. Uh, I mean, I know he's got some cows, but how many cows does he have? I was just up here when I took that the wrapper off of it. I was just noticing how much there is here. I mean, it just goes all the way back through almost. It's almost totally full. There's a ton of silage here. Um, that's that's some decent profit if you want to use it right. Man, I'm just surprised how much is there. So uh, I have a funny feeling that's going to be my job at some point. Ugh. Going to be dealing the silage pit. Oh, well, what do you do? Anyways, let's put this away. Get uh, things packed away. I think everything's locked up down below. I don't think I need to worry about anything there, so we can uh, make our way to the beach. Thanks again for joining me today, folks. You guys know what to do. If you guys did enjoy today's episode, drop that like. And, of course, don't forget to subscribe. And, guys, it's day off time. I'll see you at the beach. Have a good one, folks. We'll see you next time. From Lakeview Vale, this is Clutch. Lake Land Vale. This is Clutch over and out. I'll get it one of these days, I promise.